I-T-B-O-Y-B-B-N-O dollar sign. That's me. That's me. That's right. That's me. That's me. That's right. Uh. Good morning, guys. It is bright and early, 8.30 a.m. Today is absolutely beautiful, but it is going to be such a long day for me. Because it is spring break for the kids, we are working longer hours this week. I was in a rush this morning. All I could do for my makeup were my eyebrows and lashes. It's gonna be a busy start of the week. I only have one class this quarter, and then I'm just gonna be working full time. Very exciting. I am currently on a fitness journey. Flashback. Okay, so a little bit of a haul. Whole wheat bread, spinach, dark chocolate peanut butter cups, bananas, grapes, a salad kit, a kombucha, an avocado. I initially started my like fitness journey because I gained a lot of weight abruptly, like literally within the span of a month, but now I'm actually like low-key excited about it. So basically what I'm doing at this point in my fitness journey is I'm trying to walk 10K steps a day. I like to do a little bit of at-home Pilates, which is like a YouTube video. And then I also do a little bit of like strength training with dumbbells. I think this low impact like workout regimen really works for me. End of flashback. I'm excited to take you guys along on this week of my life. Three hours later. Hello guys, I am currently on my lunch break. I still have my still my walkie-talkie and first aid kit with me. The day has been so fun. I love my job. I love working with kids, guys. Like, it refreshes me. Also, it's fun because it's like their spring break, so like it's super chill. And we get to have such a fun like mix of kids. So they got here, we did some like discovery time. So they get to play like board games and stuff. And they ate breakfast. And then we did a little bit of homework time on like the computers. We took like a dance break. And then we started working on this egg drop project, which is gonna be super cute and super fun because it's using like Pokemon Easter eggs. We did a little bit of our trivia game. And then we are currently watching a movie and eating lunch. Also today, like, you know how some kids, like, always love talking to teachers, but other kids, like, you know, they just go about their day, and that's fine. But today, one of the kids who, like, normally doesn't, I don't really talk to him, like, too, too much, um, but he came up to me while I was, like, talking to the, my coworkers, and he was like, Miss Allison, and I was like, yeah? And he was like, I got a haircut. And I was like, nice. But I thought that was so adorable. I was like, bro, just wanted to share. Also, you know how I told you guys that I only had time to do my lashes and eyebrows today? That is like the move. One shift later. I lied, guys. I'm exhausted. <laughs> Nine hour shifts will do that to you. Also, my throat is so dry. I'm at school now. Hiromi and I are going to take a little walk and it's going to be super fun. I already almost hit my 10K steps today just from work. Yay! Yay! Yay. Happy April Fool! Oh my god, I forgot about that. Good morning, guys. It is Tuesday. It is super early. I'm super tired, but we are off to work. Three hours later. I am now on my lunch break. I basically ate at work, though. We did a sort of discovery time free choice. We did, like, meeting time, and then they worked on their egg drop projects, and we finished that today. But then we did a little bit of homework time on the computers, and now we are watching movie and doing lunch. This is the necklace that Melody bought me this Christmas, and then I'm wearing my brown hoodie from Cider, my brown bodysuit from Amazon, and then I'm just wearing the same cream pants from Paxson. All right, guys, I bought a little Reese's peanut butter cup Easter eggs on sale. So it was such a good deal. I've been trying to get my steps in like at work. So just making more of a conscious effort. Working at Disney was so good for this because literally my job was to pace up and down when I would bring in the cars and stuff. One shift later. Today was such a heartwarming day, guys. So we have a lot of students that mostly speak Japanese. One of them said my name for the first time. Also, we did recess like halfway through the day. So mind you, I had already been with these kids like half the day. And they told the kindergartners and first graders that they were gonna go with me. And they all went, yay! And they all came around and gave me this huge group hug. And it was so, so cute. And I'm like, guys, I've literally seen you since like 8.30 in the morning. Hello. Yay! Hi. Good morning, guys. I'm so exhausted, guys. Literally, I have not had a moment to myself in the past like 48 hours, and I'm not going to get one until after work. I'm vlogging down here because I'm pretty sure I can see my kids staring at me because I just drove in. Three hours later. Hello, guys. It is so hot today. Oh my gosh, it's getting to like summer weather. I was right. The kids did see me in my car. Because when I walked in, they were like, Miss Allison, we saw you in your car. We were waving. Same old, same old. We did discovery time and breakfast. They painted their little Pokemon sculptures we made yesterday, and I need to start lesson planning for next week pretty soon. We went outside and I played catch and then handball, which was really Really fun. Then we had them do some homework time, we gave them lunch, and yeah. One shift later. <laughs> Hi guys, lots of updates. First off, there's like a cut in my mouth that hurts so bad. The kids did a little bit of trivia, I believe, and then we took them outside to play again. And they worked on a race car track project. They had snack and then they worked on poetry. But for most of that time, I was working on lesson planning for next week because now I'm working full time. I'm really excited about it. And I've already got like the basis of my ideas down. For meeting time, I came up with questions for every day. So hopefully this will help us build classroom community and also help with social emotional skills. That was really what I was going for with meeting time this week. I really wanted to theme the questions around like 
being respectful, being a good friend. For homework time, I decided to keep their current like rotation sort of thing for Tuesdays and Thursdays. So I was like, they can do their reading, their like math games and like their Uno chess games. They can keep that for Tuesday, Thursdays. But for the other days, I really wanna help the students, especially with their spelling. And then we'll do a little bit of math too. But I really want to do that like interactive, like hands-on like me helping them with their spelling. For Monday, we're gonna do a sight word bingo, which I think will be really fun. For Wednesday, I couldn't really think of a math one for this week, so I was kind of like, we can just measure things around the classroom and practice that. For Friday, I wanna do group spelling practice. Then for our like activity each day, they want us to do like themes for each week. So I decided to do a mystery theme for the week or like detectives because I already did that in my old job. So. For Monday, we're gonna do a little detective case. So the students are gonna work together to find the clues and then we're gonna work on deducing the answer. For Tuesday, we're gonna make some secret codes. I'll have the students write out the alphabet, then they'll make their own symbol for each one and then they can write like messages in it. For Wednesday, we're just gonna do a scavenger hunt. For Friday, we are gonna do fingerprinting. Like we'll do it with paint, just to make it easy. And then another fingerprint mystery. And then on Friday, I'm hoping that we can do invisible ink. So after work, I came home. I did a couple little at-home Pilates things. Then I went grocery shopping with Melody. And then I went to the gym right after. And I got a great workout and I came back. I showered and then I made dinner. I was going to try to do my classwork tonight, but I don't think I have time. Good morning, guys. Outfit of the day. Black bodysuit is from Amazon. Pants are from Cider. And then necklace is from Melody. One shift later. I forgot to vlog. I got here in the morning. Same old, same old. Discovery time, breakfast. We did landscape paintings. I had them do a story read along. And then we set up lunch. So they did their homework time. And they watched the entire SpongeBob movie. They were so into it. And then we went outside. And then after that, we came back in. We did some trivia. And then we went back outside. And then we came in for discovery time. I'm going to head home now make some dinner and then I have my singing lesson and acapella. Oh. I finished my slides and stuff for next week for work and then I watched my lectures for class and then I practiced my acapella songs just a little bit because I skipped today's rehearsal and I'm not going tomorrow to the La La Land rehearsal. Now I'm at Ezra's. I think I just I need to go to sleep. My friend. I'm crumbling. Good morning guys, outfit of the day. I am wearing my milk and mocha sweater that I got from Etsy for Ezra and me. And then I have my turtleneck from, I think, Shein. And then my pants are from Old Navy. One shift later. The day is over. So we did the usual discovery time and breakfast in the morning. We did a little bit of journaling. They finished their race car tracks. We gave them some time on the computers, did lunch, did trivia, went outside, did some like skits or plays and then we did snack finished the trivia game and then we just did discovery time and they went home so that is the end of working overtime every single day this week we're gonna go back to our normal hours next week i'm going out with the girlies tonight it's gonna be super fun so i also need to pick them up i'm excited to get ready get all prettied up i need to figure out what i'm gonna wear i bought this dress for a wedding that Ezra and i are going to i think the chest part just looks really weird Here is my going outfit for tonight. The top is from Amazon, pants are from American Eagle. I am going to go pick up Hiromi and everybody else right now. Okay, now it's a bit Hello! <laughs> <laughs> I am tired and cold, and the music was not good today. Good morning, guys. It's currently like 1.30, but I woke up this morning, hung out with Ezra for a little bit, and then I took a nap. I really needed just some time to rot in bed after this week. A lot of the education, like readings and stuff that I'm doing make me very sad, I'm not gonna lie. But they're also really interesting. For now, the only class that I'm in is about adolescent development, but also I've been reading my books for grad school, so this is one of them. Guys, my reflection is already getting so long and I haven't even done the last reading yet. I think these topics are just so interesting. Yay for finishing all of week one's homework in like, a few hours because I only have one class. I realized that I never announced it on here, but I got into grad school at UCI, guys. Now I'm gonna go work out. Slay. I am currently working on setting up a teacher portfolio. Along the way, while I'm doing my master's program and student teaching and everything, I can start putting this together. So once I graduate, I'll have it mostly done. I just wanna start setting up like the outline for it. Birthday party outfit. As was vacuuming. Party hats are from Target. Top is from Amazon. Bottoms are from Amazon. This is the party makeup. I tried to put a little bit of sparkle, but you guys can't really see. Ah, ice cream. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Shark tablecloth. The crafts. <laughs> Ooh, and the hats. I gotta make sure I give those out. 
the Smisky unboxing. He's working. Yes. What are my options? You're a woman at work. I am a woman at work. Ooh, oh, he's teaching. <laughs> yeah, I thought you would like that That's one. so me. What is he doing? <laughs> <laughs> One, two, three. Yeah! 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 And then you'll have to talk to them. Or it will be. Happy birthday, dear Allison. Happy birthday to you. It's my birthday. Started my birthday with Godzilla X Kong. Going through my present. So Ezra got me this tote bag. My mom got me my new day designer for next year, so I'm currently unboxing that. Look at him. He's wearing my shirt. From my brother, I got my new Converse, but I'm not gonna wear them until my grad photos because I want them to stay white. And then my dad also got me my running shoes, but I've already been wearing those. And my aunt got me the Tomorrowland ears I wanted. Look at the birthday confetti she added. They're so cute. From Melody. The next morning. Hi guys, here's the birthday outfit. Amazon, cider, Walmart, and the necklaces from Melody. And of course my Ezra bracelet. Today's gonna be very fun. I went to the gym, now I'm going to work. I'm gonna have my singing lesson, I think, and then Ezra and I are gonna go to Cape Barbecue. Hello friends, what an amazing birthday that was. I did not expect my job to do all that they did for me. Like, I fully expected like nothing, you know? They went all out, they baked me a cake, they got me balloons, cookies, this crown. It was so, so sweet and I'm so touched. And then the kids were so cute. Like the kindergartners were all really excited about my birthday. And the older kids too wished me happy birthday. Everyone sang to me. I also had my kids sign my stole, so that's really exciting. All of my friends have shown me so, so much love today and I'm so grateful guys. That's when I got K barbecue and then I showed him around where I work and I had him buy a dessert earlier today from this small business that I love. Now I want to watch Kong Skull Island and then go to bed. Literally I have had the best birth week. I literally feel so so loved by all of my friends, my co-workers, my kids. I also had my singing lesson and I got to sing you know whatever I wanted. I'm gonna go ahead and end the vlog here. I hope you guys enjoyed and I will talk to you next time. Bye guys!